Okay, we will show here that given f from c to c is analytic function, then fz bar is analytic if and only if f is a constant function. Okay, first of all, f is a function from c to c. We just write it as fz is equal to u xy plus i vxy where u comma v are function from r2 to r okay we need to show that f given fz bar is analytic to to show f is a constant We are taking the case 1, there will be 2 cases. We are taking the case 1 first. Okay, first of all, how does fz bar looks like? fz bar is equal to fx plus iy bar. This will be equal to fx minus, minus iy. We can also write it as x plus i minus y. This is equal to u x minus y plus i v x minus y from the definition. The way we have defined u and v. So, okay, this is an analytic function. So it will satisfy and let's just call it u1 xy plus i v1 xy for the convenience. It will satisfy CR equation. So u1 x is equal to v1 y and v1x is equal to minus u1y hmm. now looking at the equations u1x is equal to ux minus yx which will be simply ux at x minus y and v1 y will be equal to v x minus y y which will do minus v x minus y let me rewrite it again u1 x is equal to u x minus y x derivative which will be equal to simple u x minus y u x minus y there is nothing problem in that but when we take v1 y this will be equal to v x minus y y and due to this negative of y we will get minus v y x comma minus y now as f is equal to u plus i v is analytic given so it will satisfy cr equation thus we have u x is equal to v y this implies u x x comma y is equal to v y x comma y for all x y in particular u x x comma minus y is equal to v y x comma minus y but here we have u x 
x comma minus y is equal to minus v y comma x comma minus y as u one x is equal to v one y. We have seen here u one x is equal to v one y, and u one x is this, and v one y is this. So these two here are equal. So we have two two of these equation. What does this imply? This implies that u u x x comma minus y is equal to minus times u x x comma minus y. This implies u x comma x comma minus y is equal to zero. Similarly, we can show that. Similarly, we can show that v x comma x comma minus y is equal to zero. V y comma x comma minus y is equal to zero. And u y comma x comma minus y is equal to zero. And they are what we have shown that u and x is equal to zero. V and x is equal to zero. And s fz bar dash will be equal to u1 x plus i v1 x because it is a simple formula that fz z is equal to u x plus i v x using this formula we are saying this fz bar is equal to because we have taken u1 for fz bar and v1 for fz bar case these are zero, so f z bar dash is equal to zero. This implies that f z bar is a constant function. Thus, f is a constant function. So we have proved that f is a constant function. For the case 2, we need to show that given f is a constant function, to show f and f z bar are analytic. is constant implies fz bar is constant as constants are analytic both are analytic 